Okay, so in this assignment breakdown, I want to take two questions that students find to be particularly difficult in the first mathematics-based lab that I give my students as a refresher to make sure they're ready for the type of math they'll encounter in any undergraduate biomechanics class. And these two questions are right here, number 12 and number 13. And the reason that they seem to be so challenging for students is that they are based on the trigon trigonometric functions that we come across when we are doing vector addition and resolution. So I want to go through these one at a time and then that way you will have a good idea of how to do these types of problems when you encounter them. So let's start with number 12. And I'm gonna just kind of, we'll do number 12 so here to start. And values within vector resolution and addition and always just start with what you know and then compare it to the equations that you have to find an equation that has the unknown in it and all other variables accounted for. So let's go ahead we're going to erase this and we're going to do number 13. So this is exactly how to do these type of equations where you are trying to do vector resolution and addition and finding takeoff angles or movement angles of objects in motion. 